Most Americans just enjoyed a three-day weekend, but not our soldiers in Iraq. A documentary about CBS News correspondent Kimberly Dozier, which airs tomorrow, reminded me yet again of so many acts of courage and sacrifice. Kimberly and her camera crew, Paul Douglas and James Brolin, went out on a patrol with a unit from the 4th Infantry Division. A car bomb went off. Paul and James were killed instantly, as was the captain of the 4th ID and his Iraqi translator. Six of the soldiers were seriously wounded. Kimberly literally died on the table, but thanks to a slew of generous soldiers who donated their blood, she survived. From Kimberly's scarred legs to Sergeant Nathan Reed's missing one, from two fatherless girls to the agonizing guilt of the sergeant who feels he let his captain down, the collateral damage was devastating. One bomb, one day in Iraq, so many lives shattered. Remember them and honor them. That's the least we can do. That's a page from my notebook. I'm Katie Couric, CBS News.